Welcome to Easy EDM. I'm going to show you a few techniques on this solid model that has a couple of tapers on these holes. There's six of them. So let's get our coordinate system lined up first. We're going to put it at the bottom of the block. So you just go to View, UCS on Geometry, and select Circles. So we'll put it right on that circle there. Top View. Okay, we're in the wrong orientation, so we're just going to go to Edit, Rotate X. 180 degrees and select geometry and surfaces. So let's take a closer look at those tapers. So I'm just going to blank all, select surfaces, and we'll take a look at that guy right there. Side view. So we have a taper at the bottom and a taper at the top. Now let's get some more information. If we go and select the top of our block, we're at 0.877, so that's the thickness. Then we come to where the two surfaces join together, the two tapers, and we'll notice that that's 0.80472. Now we need to get our taper degrees, so we're going to go to Dimensions, Check Angle. It's 88 degrees, so it's only 2 degrees from 90, so that's a 2 degree taper. And that registers at 93 degrees, so that's a 3 degree taper. So now we need to create the paths for our wire to follow. So we're going to go to Curves XY Intersection, and we're going to split the model right at that intersection there. Now to make things a little simple, I'm just going to delete the unwanted curves I created, or paths, and then I'll work with those six. So now what we want to do is we want to transfer that curve, all these curves, up to the top of our model. So we're going to use the Move command. We're going to move from here to the top and select all curves. Now we're going to create our start and end points for these curves. We can do that automatically with our auto start for all curves. Now these would be dies, and we'll make a 50,000 lead in, lead out. So and you can see we have those lead in and lead outs on all of them. Next thing we do is we go to our die wizard. The die type is going to be number seven. We have two tapers. The thickness is going to be that 0.877 that I pointed out earlier. We'll put in a stop length. Our Z position where the two tapers come together, that is 0.877. 80472. The top angle is 2 degrees, the bottom angle is 3 degrees. So I'm going to go to Advance, and then we're going to select the curves we want to machine. Hit the Auto button. So our upper the upper and the upper guide is going to be the same. Verify. Okay, so we have our wire paths. Let's take a look at a side view, turn the shading off. And you can see we get a nice taper for both sides. Now we'll do a 3D preview. Side view. And your part's complete. Thank you for watching.